In this video we are going to see installation of HVAC.Work Methods and Statements Part 1. If you are watching our videos first time subscribe to our YouTube channel this will help us to make more videos and don't forget to click the bell icon button you will never miss our latest videos. Welcome to Controls and Systems YouTube channel. Scope and Purpose this method statement covers the on-site installation of HVAC ductwork and accessories and the requirement of checks to be carried out. Reference documents. Project specifications. Approved shop drawings. Latest revision. Approved material submittals. Ductwork standard OW144. General materials. HVAC ductwork generally includes all types of supply air duct, return air duct, fresh and exhaust air duct and their accessories such as duct elbows, offsets, transformation pieces branch off pieces, T connections, access doors, fire dampers, volume control dampers, sound attenuators, flexible ducting and insulation, general equipment, portable grinding machine, drilling machine, sheet metal cutting tools and bender, spirit level, scaffolding, duct director hand tools, testing instruments, air compressor, Responsible personnel, project engineers, construction in charge, site engineer and site supervisor, QA and QC inspectors, safety officer, site foreman, pipe fitters and welders, helpers, method of pre-installation, ensure that approved material required to carry out work will be available, prior to commencement of work, area and access will be inspected to confirm that the site is ready to commence the work. All relevant documentation and material applicable to particular section of works will be checked by site engineer before commencement. Physical verification of material will be carried out for any damages prior to taking from stores. The site engineer or supervisor will give necessary instruction to tradesmen and provide necessary construction shop drawings. The site engineer or supervisor will also check that tools and equipment available are in compliance to contract requirements. The site supervisor also explains tradesmen regarding safety precautions to be observed. Prior to leak testing, site engineer will ensure that calibrated test kit is available and are in good condition. Method of installation 1. Prior to commencement of work coordination will be done with other. 2. Determine the position of duct supports as per approved construction layouts and specification. 3. Prepare and fix the duct supports as per approved construction drawing and specification. 4. Any cut edges of angles, channels or threaded rods will be touch up with zinc rich paint. 5. Transport the duct pieces and fittings to final location. 6. Preassemble the duct pieces and fittings as per approved shop drawing ensuring the alignment. 7. Acoustic insulation will be carried out wherever required. 8. Raise the ductwork onto the supports ensuring that each length is aligned with preceding length as per dimension shown on approved shop. 9. Approved duct sealant shall be applied on the joints. Any excess sealant so that the joint left in clean and tidy condition. 10. Ensure the ductwork is clean and no tools slash construction debris exists within ductwork before proceeding to next length. 11. All open ends of the ductworks shall be temporarily sealed with polythene sheets, plywood before leaving the job site to prevent moisture and dirt. 12. Ensure that all accessories like volume control dampers, fire dampers, access doors, test points, sensors are installed in accordance with approved shop drawings. 13. Install sound attenuators according to approved shop drawings. 14. Installation of ductwork complete with accessories, shall be checked before applying insulation at joints. 15. Leak test will be carried out for duct work as applicable in DW144 standard. 16. Insulation of duct work will be completed as per manufacturer's recommendations, copy and closed. 17. Ensure the duct surface is clean and dry before applying any insulation material. 18. Ensure the thickness of insulation as per approved shop drawing. 19. Ensure that all edge joints are closely butted and ends are flush and seated properly. 20. Apply a lug glass tape, self-adhesive aluminum foil laminated on glass fabric, as joints of insulation. 21. 
Ensure the continuity of vapor barrier and other protective coatings on insulation surface as well as at connections. 22. Ensure firm adherence of insulation around ducting by using approved adhesive between sheet metal and insulation material. 23. Where insulated ductwork passes through fire-rated wall, partitions the gap between sleeve and ductwork shall be filled with approved fire barrier, quality control. QCE along with project engineer and site supervisor will monitor that all components are installed as per the contract specifications and approved submittals. Inspection request, IR, shall be submitted to the main contractor, consultant during the following stages, after completion of installation before testing, leak testing of duct work, after complete installation, safety, work will commence as per safety regulations laid down in the contract specification and project safety plan. Proper safety harness to be used and secured, if required. All personal protective equipment shall be used as appropriate according to the nature of job. Housekeeping shall be of good standard and all cut lengths and debris shall be removed. Good ventilation for ductwork insulation shall be ensured. Well we hope this video is useful to you. Thank you for watching our video. We will meet in another good video. Have a great day.